aí, pessoal, eu tô aqui na IBC, no stand da Black Magic, e estou aqui com o Bob, que vai falar um pouquinho da nova câmera de cinema deles, 4K, 4K RAW. E ele vai falar um pouquinho pra gente também da, uh, da, do, do, de como que a Black Magic começou a fabricar a câmera. So, hi again, Bob. And, uh, well, for me, uh, Black Magic, until a, a couple of years ago, was just a, a, a manufacturer of uh, video equipment, but only uh, cards and uh, computer cards and stuff like this. And out of nowhere, you came out with a huge announcement of a camera, and it was really crazy when i saw it I, i i was expecting something like this from maybe gopro or i mean other camera manufacturers but not from from black magic and then you guys came and really raised the bar raised the level and can you tell me why why black magic started in cameras sure well if you look at it um what we decided was we needed we wanted to build a, a good acquisition device for the entire workflow of post-production So from production through post-production, we, we have DaVinci Resolve. So we uh, interact with lots of different camera file formats and whatnot. And we thought, wow, what if we were able to record in a file format that you could use right away? So Cinema DNG Raw, DNX HD, or Apple ProRes, and boom, you could just use it right away. So we tried to eliminate some of the bottlenecks of other workflows, and that's where we're at. And when you really look at it, a lot of the products that we already make are in the camera. You know, we already made a monitor. We already have uh, I.O. We have Thunderbolt products. We have an SSD recorder. So it's sort of like we just put a sensor in the front it of it. Just, it. It was just a matter of buying a sensor and putting on the camera. Exactly. And, you know, we don't sell lenses, but len plenty of lenses are out there. And our thoughts were for the DSL community, uh, DSLR guys, they already have a bunch of lenses. So let's make something so they can shoot stills with that camera and maybe put uh, the same lens on, on our cameras and, uh, and go and, and get it without having to do all the special sauce. Okay, and so this camera beside us is the new 4K camera, right? Yes, absolutely. This is the new 4K camera. Uh, this has a 6 gig SDI output with 4K, uh, Thunderbolt. All of the same basic feature set of the original 2.5K, but with a full 35 sensor. So it'll record raw and it's going to and record uh, ProRes 4K. All right, that's pretty amazing. This is a pretty amazing camera, and uh, I'm I'm really uh, amazed how Blackmagic came from not doing any camera to, to really bringing something of this high level at this price range. Because honestly, for for 3,145 euros, there's not much much you can buy on this this level of quality, right? Well, that's right, and, and that's part of our operation. We do high volume, and we want to do aggressive pricing so that we can get you know a large number of units out, and we want to enable the masses. It's part of the magic here at Black Magic to be able to get the pricing right and get the products at really high quality. And I, I mean, I can uh, vouch for that because, well, since you, since when you were doing uh, cards, uh, like preview cards and uh, 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 video editing cards, I, I was buying that, and they were really cheaper than, than the, the concurrence and, and much better, that, that's something that, that we should say. So uh, when I buy this camera, I also get the DaVinci Resolve. And uh, what, what else yeah, comes you with? get the DaVinci Resolve software, and then if you take Thunderbolt out to a laptop, you can run our scope, so you can check levels. All right. Well, thank you very much, Bob. E é isso aí, pessoal. Se vocês querem saber, tem mais vídeos da Decklink e da IBC 2013 para vocês assistirem. Então você pode se inscrever aqui no nosso canal do YouTube ou se você estiver no Facebook, dá um curtir na nossa página e segue a gente. Até mais, pessoal.